Honest Thief. Released in the year 2020, IMDb rating 6.1. They call him the In-N-Out Bandit because meticulous thief Tom Carter has stolen $9 million from small-town banks while managing to keep his identity a secret. But when he falls in love with Bubbly Annie, Tom decides to make a fresh start by coming clean about his criminal past. Only to be double-crossed by two ruthless FBI agents. To deal with this. Pretty cool. Ready to confess? Cold Pursuit. Released in the year 2019, IMDb rating 6.2. This movie is about quiet family man and hard-working snowplow driver Nels is the lifeblood of a glitzy resort town in the Rocky Mountains because he is the one who keeps the winter roads clear. He and his wife live in a comfortable cabin away from the tourists. The town has just awarded him Citizen of the Year. But Nels has to leave his quiet mountain life when his son is murdered by a powerful drug lord. As a man who has nothing to lose he is stoked by a drive for vengeance. This unlikely hero uses his hunting skills and transforms from an ordinary man into a skilled killer as he sets out to dismantle the cartel. Nels' actions ignite a turf war between a manically unpredictable gangster known as Viking and a rival gang boss. Justice is served in one final spectacular confrontation that will leave almost no one unscathed. This doesn't happen in Kyo. It just did. Nels Cox. Taken 2. Released in the year 2012, IMDb rating 6.2. This movie is about the retired CIA agent Brian Mills invites his teenage daughter Kim and his ex-wife Lenore, who has separated from her second husband, to spend a couple of days in Istanbul where he is working. Meanwhile, the patriarch of the community of the Albanian gang of human trafficking, Murad Krasniki, seeks revenge for the death of his son and organizes another gang to kidnap Brian and his family. Brian and Lenore are abducted by the Albanians. But Kim escapes and is the only hope that Brian has to escape and save Lenore. People are gonna come for you too. What are you going? The Commuter. Released in the year 2018, IMDb rating 6.3. This movie is about Michael McCauley, a former police officer and now a hard-working life insurance salesman and a caring family man, has been taking the commuter rail to New York for the past 10 years. But things will take an unexpected turn when, on one of his daily journeys, the cryptic passenger, Joanna, makes Michael a generous and tempting offer to locate a single commuter or face grave consequences. Is this a sick joke, or is this... Indeed, a dangerous situation. Now, as Michael races against the clock to solve this wicked conundrum, everyone aboard is a suspect, in a deal that there is more than meets the eye. Can he decide in time who is the one? What do you want from me? A Walk Among the Tombstones Released in the year 2014, IMDb rating 6.5, this movie is about former cop Matt Scudder is now a private eye. He is asked by a drug dealer to find the men who kidnapped his wife. It seems like they killed her even after he paid them. Scudder refuses, but the man later goes to see him and tells him how his wife was killed. Scudder takes the job. He does some research and thinks the men he is looking for have done this more than once and that everyone they grabbed is connected to a drug dealer. He is about to give up when they grab another girl and Scudder tries make sure she's returned alive. So I have a new player in the game. In my eyes is no one no hides the face. The other two, they're the ones you put over. Run All Night, released in the year 2015. IMDb rating 6.6, .6. this movie is about professional Brooklyn hitman Jimmy Conlon is more commonly known as the Gravedigger. Jimmy was a mob hitman, who was best friends with his boss Sean McGuire. But when Jimmy's son, Michael, is marked for death by the mob, Jimmy must go up against Sean to protect Michael at all costs. Together, he and Michael must avoid corrupt cops, contract killers and the mob to survive the night. Michael. Got in tonight. Tell everyone to get Jimmy's coming. I know how this works. 
about staying alive. Best chance you've got. I've got the wrong motive. You've got to worry about on the Unknown, released in the year 2011. IMDb rating 6.8. This movie is about a biochemist and his dishy wife arrive in Berlin for a conference at which a scientist and his controversial Arab funder will announce breakthrough research while his wife checks into the hotel. He grabs a cab to return to the airport for his briefcase. Left at the curb, en route. An auto accident puts him in a coma, from which he awakes four days later without identification and with gaps in his memory. He goes to the hotel. His wife refuses to recognize him and another man has claimed his identity, with help from a nurse. The cab driver, a retired Stasi agent, and an academic friend, he tries to unravel what's going on, is the answer in the briefcase. I don't know who this man will die. There is no more. I didn't. The Grey, released in the year 2011. IMDb rating 6.8, this movie is about in Alaska. A team of oil workers board a flight home, however. They cross a storm and the airplane crashes. Only seven workers survive in the wilderness and John Otway, who is a huntsman that kills wolves to protect the workers, assumes leadership of the group. Shortly after they learn that they are surrounded by a pack of wolves and Otway advises that they should seek protection in the woods. But while they walk through the heavy snow, they are chased and attacked by the carnivorous mammals. Feel near. Non-stop. Released in the year 2014. IMDb rating 6.9. This movie is about Bill Marks. A former cop dealing with his daughter's death by drinking is now a federal air marshal. While on a flight from New York to London, Marks gets a text telling him that unless $150 million is transferred to an offshore account, Someone will die every 20 minutes. Can he find the terrorist in time and save everyone? Gentlemen, I need every passenger to- know what the hell is going- This is a setup. Something else is going on. The FBI, the White House, and Air Marshal. Agent Marks are fighting- I'm not- Taken. Released in the year 2008. IMDb rating 7.8. This movie is about 17-year-old Kim is the pride and joy of her father Brian Mills. Brian is a retired agent who left the Central Intelligence Agency to be near Kim in California. Kim lives with her mother Lenore and her wealthy stepfather Stuart. Kim manages to convince her reluctant father to allow her to travel to Paris with her friend Amanda. When the girls arrive in Paris they share a cab with a stranger named Peter and Amanda lets it slip that they are alone in Paris. Using this information, an Albanian gang of human traffickers kidnaps the girls. Kim barely has time to call her father and give him information. Thanks for watching this video. Do like, comment, share and subscribe for more videos.